Welcome back to Elden Ring. Let's explore Elphile, Brace of the Halleck Tree. Oh, I could totally fall down there. They explode. Oh, it's so bright, this bowl. Hear a beetle somewhere. Okay, there's a lot of ways to go. A tree avatar. I think it's one of the Putrescent ones, it looks scarlet rotty. Beetle sounds so close. Oh, yeah, it's just down there. No, it's just a healing thing. Don't need it. It's a little hard to pick where I want to go. Oh yeah, wait, what was this again? Oh, Loretta's War Sickle. Right, I need to upgrade this thing. Okay, well, I think if I fall off up here, it's just going to lead down there anyway. There's a hole in the roof here. Oh yeah, I guess I could... Probably take that out. 
Um, I don't think Comet would reach. Not quite, but Loretta's Mastery definitely will. What? Huh. Oh, it just teleported to the other side, I guess. Is that just a defense when you try to snipe it? Ooh. Triple ring of light. Probably an incantation. Um, hmm. Well, it is an incantation, but it takes faith and int, weirdly enough. Not too common, most things only take faith. Okay, that's going to be a bit of a problem. Oh Christ. <laughs> I didn't realize I was so low on health. Okay, maybe fighting it from a distance is not a good idea. I mean, I could do that if I was really, really patient, but why? I think it'd be easier just to get down there and just do something that allows them to do different attacks. Oh yeah, I want to go upgrade my sickle. War sickle upgraded to plus nine, so almost maxed. Yeah, how does the damage compare actually? Compared to say the Bolt of Grand Sacks. So for physical, this has 225 plus 120. This has 253 plus 155. And then the magic damage, this thing, oh. This thing does lightning, 145 plus 69. This does magic, 163 plus 101. So yeah, this does significantly more damage. Just because it scales better with my stats. Yeah, this thing only scales with dex. 
like, I mean, it does with strength as well, but dex is like the only significant one. This one scales with dex and int. It doesn't scale great with anything. It's just C scaling, but it scales with a bunch of things. This thing is just so pretty, and I really got to try out the special. Hmm. Okay, so it's not great for confined spaces, for sure. I don't even want to attack it and it's still attacking me. I'm not totally sold on the special for this. It looks cool, but the damage it does is only slightly more than just two normal attacks. So why do it? What's the advantage? Maybe it does more poise damage? Probably. But it's not even breaking the poise of these regular soldiers. No, thank you. I can definitely jump down there and fight the, like, putrid tree avatar. We kill a knight's sword. Ooh. Ah, oh, scales with faith. That looks so pretty. Sword forged by servants of Mikella of the Halic Tree with a design modeled after those carried by Carrion Knights. Instead of glintstone, however, amber from the Halic Tree is embedded in the blade. A sumptuous piece, yet it has never been offered to any knight. An ill-starred sword with no master. And Sacred Blade grants armaments attacks Holy Essence and fires off a golden blade projectile. So satisfying. I don't want to do it on them because it might drop me off of here. <laughs> Somebody jumped up on the eggs. Wait, is that an NPC? No, I just couldn't target them before for some reason. Oh, that's 
even better than Comet. It one hit kills them. I'm Chef Peter's attack again. How does that compare to Comet? I think it's about the same as Comet. So yeah, this little place we saw before where the stairs go up just takes you here. Let's go fight the putrid tree avatar. Oh, one of those things. Lovely. Oh my god. Okay, I think we'll be fine this time. doesn't do amazing damage. Rotten Staff. I have no healing left. Oh, I still have the magic damage negation. I don't really need that. So let's do the Halic Drake Talisman plus two. Boost my holy protection. Oh yeah, I think my physic also increases my lightning damage. That's why it's making that sparking noise. I should maybe change that as well. It's using that for Loretta. Was it Loretta? What are the last boss was that I fought? Yeah, Loretta. Somewhere I can't otherwise get. Well, I guess I can't go back up, so <laughs> we're committed. Uh, 
Oh man, that increased lightning damage is really showing. 2,000 damage. <laughs> Just stun locked. I feel bad for them. What the hell was that? Heard something breaking. Try up. Someone spotted me. Oh. I actually could use more FP. Let me see if I can get this with... Loretta's Mastery. Ah, oh, yes. Give me three more FP potions. I also want this one for health. I badly need it. It's just right up there. get up there. I do want to kill that thing from down here, although if I get its attention, it might teleport up here, right? I know it can teleport. It can it teleport up, though? I don't want to risk it.
Okay, well, I definitely don't... Oh, shit. Yeah, I don't think I want to go that way. Especially now with no healing potions. Where to go? There's so many just places. Do I just fall down somewhere? I guess I'll just go down here. Be wary of strong foe. Talking about that nasty thing we've seen walking around, I'm sure. Oh no. Wait, I don't think it spotted me. No. It spawned, but it didn't spot me. Maybe I should laser beam it. Jesus. Let's try that again. Perhaps laser beam? Yeah. Oh god. Let me target you! Okay, laser beam for all of them with a potion that boosts my damage. a solid plan. I just think I need to start shooting the laser slightly quicker. No, what is it about this one? How come I can't kill this one before it jumps at me?
Marika's Sore Seal. Didn't we have something similar to that? We have Radigan's Scar Seal and Sore Seal. Marika's Scar Seal and Sore Seal. Okay, so what's the difference between the Scar Seal and the Sore Seal? Raises attributes, but also increases damage taken. Greatly raises attributes, but also increases damage taken. Okay, so what's the difference? It... Instead of raising... My stats, like it raises four of the stats, Int, Faith, Arcane, and Mind by three, but instead of three, it does five. So it raises it all by five. I wonder if it also increases the damage you take by more. So yes, it raises your attributes by more, but it also does increase your damage taken by even more than it did before. So before it was a 10% increase to damage taken, but with this one, it's 15%. And again, I, I don't think it's worth it because the only ones that matter are just mind and intelligence. Faith and arcane are completely 100% pointless for me. So I really don't think it's worth it. This one, it really is worth it because it affects four stats, all of which are used. Vigor controls health, endurance controls stamina, and equipment load, strength, which is, it does give a bit more damage for weapons because I think pretty much all weapons scale to some degree with strength. And also, I think I'm actually relying on it to be able to use certain weapons one-handed. So if I got rid of it, I would need to put some more into strength. And dex, which is also, of course, important for my weapon, because I'm a dex build. So yeah, like, this one's worth it, but the other one, no. Okay, now there's going to be more of those damn things the other way. Yeah, and I'm, I'm not loving the special of Loretta's War Sickle. The basic damage is very good because it scales with Int, but I think I want to go back to the one that gives me the special form, Dragon King's Cragblade. Could try that on these mont oh it was really cool but yeah they don't seem to have breakable poise found beast blood there gives me an idea. I wonder if they could be attracted with the beast pots. Nope, they don't care. is for sure going to spawn one if I try to get that in there. Yeah, 
And they're gone. I assume it's going to appear behind me. No. Oh no. Whew. Okay, I don't think we have to fight those damn things anymore. So there's two ladders. Which one's more likely to lead to a shortcut? I have absolutely no idea. Let's go up here. Did I go in there? I don't think I did. You worry of group. Oh. Uh, do I have anything good against do against them? Would this be any good? No. Nope. This. No, that's terrible. I think I, I think I need my trusty uh, flail. Let's get past it. Flail, flail. There it is. Oh yeah. Oldie but a goodie. Now said be wary of group. So is there more than one of those things? Oh yeah. Oh my god. One down. Ah. Don't rot me. Don't rot me. I, 
I'm scared to touch it. Like, if it hits me once, I think I'm gonna have Scarlet Rot. It seems like after you break their poise, when I do wild strikes, it keeps interrupting them. But it, I tried just opening with wild strikes, and it didn't stop them. Uh, but yeah, forget the jump attack thing. I think I need more rot protection. What was the thing that gives you rot? Blood, frost, poison, and rot. Immunizing horn charm. Shame I don't have a plus two for it. Actually, I don't think I have a plus two for any of them. Maybe there is no plus two. I think there's an item that makes my negation go up. Um, immunity. It looks like that does stack with the talisman. It's gonna top up. Okay, come find me out here. Probably just those three. What was that? It's like a burst of light. Is that really all that's in here? Not worth it for all the pain and suffering it caused me. Wait a minute, was that guy there before? Because I don't remember fighting him. Maybe he just... Maybe they just don't attack you? No, they do. Uh, nope. No, face the right way. <sighs> this little place has been an absolute nightmare. Oh, fake chest. Get 
there's still that other ladder. And there's also the stairs up. Oh, that's one of the Divine Towers, isn't it? Wait, is it? No, I guess not. Those are just all over the place here. Revenge. Oh no. Fuck. Oh great. Yeah. I'm just gonna run through and that didn't work too well. I bet there's a bonfire right in there. Okay, just ran past that fucking demon down there. Oh no. All right, we're good. Ah. Back to this part. Electry soldier ashes. Spirits of common soldiers who carry the sacred light. When weakened, they explode to deliver a last ditch attack. This was the bitter revelation discovered by the desperate soldiers who awaited the return of their lord to the rotted Halleck tree. May the flesh of our deaths guide Mikello's return. Rotted Halleck tree. Rotted with scarlet rot. Okay, let's not do that. Let's do this. Jump up here. I think my shield is terrible. Holy protection. Holy. Yeah, 27% holy protection. Don't know if I'm safe from those swings. Probably not.
All right. Hmm. That's a thing in there. I can always drop down from up there. I did it! Electrine Knight Helm. Yeah, quite similar to the Lindell Knight Helm. Like, same, same base, I think. Graced by a crown of un unalloyed gold. Unalloyed gold. Increases faith. Oh. By two. Oh yeah, you could have gotten here from down there, and there is a side of grace here. Ah, finally I got a thing. Oh, you are strong. Oh, you are very strong. What if it's just their shield that has amazing magic protection or what? They were barely taking any damage. Oh, the tree spirit's not coming back, right? No. Ooh, yeah, that's much better. And it pushes them back, so I can stun lock them. Wait, maybe not. Maybe only when they have the shield down. Oh, Jesus, that almost killed me in one hit. Dude, everything here kills me in like well, two hits. I want to get one at a time, but it doesn't seem possible. Quick, 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 quick. If I time this right... Get off! Get off! Damn it! Oh, he got off anyway. I think this is gonna have to be how I do it. <laughs> Healed. Don't you dare guard counter. Okay, that weapon did work a lot better, I think because it's, um, what is it, a great hammer? I think when it's in the, like, great status, 
it does a lot more poise damage and yeah it's, it's like making them flinch whereas the other attacks don't so i think being such a big weapon is actually really helpful here yeah the damage is actually pretty good when they don't have their shield up Even that normal ass arrow did more than half my health worth of damage. Did more than one potion can heal. <laughs> He's healed up to full. One down, two to go. Again, these, yeah, these, uh, these two enemies are literally harder than Loretta. episode here because I need to take a break. The difficulty spike is bizarre in this place. Again, all these common enemies are actually, they've been way, way, way harder than Loretta. A boss fight that we just did in this location, in the Halleck tree. I don't get it. It's very weird. But yeah, I need to take a break. So hope you've enjoyed so far and I'll be back soon.